So everybody knows what's going on. They know the story. They know the conflict. They know the misconduct. They know the controversy. They know the breakup. They know the breakdown. I'm single. For the last few weeks now, I have been single. I have been on the lookout. I have been seeing. I have been thinking. I have been trying. I have been doing everything I can to secure another relationship because my girlfriend moved on very quickly, very easily. No problem. It was good. It's better for her to her. She's moved on to bigger and better things. So what Sean Dream has done is he's went out and he's looked high and low. He's looked left and right. He's looked in front and behind. And I have seen it all. I've seen a lot of things in the last several weeks that I've been single. A lot of things that have went down. A lot of things that have transpired. I am glad and happy to say that I have a girlfriend that will trust me, that will be with me, that will be for me, that will think the same as me, that will do the same as me, that will be on the same level as me. Someone who will never ever leave me, someone that will never go away, someone that will stick to what they stick to, somebody who has the kind of respect and pride and dignity, somebody that is true to their word, somebody that will stick by you literally and figuratively, somebody that will mean what they say and say what they mean, someone that is so attached, someone that is got all those variables, it's someone that will reach the potential, somebody that will mean forever, somebody that has that, that, that mutual admiration for you, a love and a lust like no other. So ladies and gentlemen, I am here to announce on February the 17th, it's like a drug, it's something you're addicted to. It's almost like it's something you need. You have to have it. And you're going to have it no matter what. Regardless, this is what you're going to have. And the expectation and the anticipation of this next girlfriend isn't at an all-time high. I mean, it is fever pitch. Like I said, my girlfriend left me. That same night she left me, she went out with her boyfriend. And she moved on as if six or seven years didn't mean a damn thing. So what I'm going to do and what I have done is, like I said... I have hurried, I have scurried, I have done all those things. I don't even know if that's a word, but it doesn't matter if it's a word because the word is the day is relationship, is together, is never leaving, is final. Because here on February the 17, 2017, that's right, mark the date down on your calendar, a moment, a moment in time. A day that I will never forget where I got a new girlfriend and I am going to introduce her. I am going to show her. I am going to maneuver her. I am going to dominate her. I am going to show the world who this person is. And it's not just any person. It is a person who has seen it all. A person that has a heart. A person that has persevered, a person that has worked their ass off, a person, then again, doesn't really necessarily have to be a person. Is it a guy? Is it a girl? Have I turned bi, lie, lesbian, in between, outside, inside? Whoop. I don't know. But all I know is this, this is this 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 girlfriend is going to be very trustworthy. They are going to be there, they're going to stick with me, and they have stuck with me. And they're going to continue to stick with me. Ladies and gentlemen, February the 17, 2017, the brand new girlfriend of Sean Junior Damon is not just one girlfriend, but two girlfriend. My righty and my lefty, because righty and lefty, these hands are going to embark on more journeys and more heartbreak and more heartache. No, actually, no, you're not going to do that to me. These hands were made to love and express and joy and find. These hands weren't made for fighting. They weren't made... Well, they, they, my left and right hand are on my dates. They are my relationships. They have stuck by me. They've never left me. They've never been cut off me. They've... They, my hands, nice and soft, but I'm not going to be soft as an S-A-W-F-T. What I'm going to be is with these two hands, 
a lot is going to happen. A lot is going to be made. And this is breaking news because knowing that I'm not single anymore, knowing that I got my two hands as my date, as my significant other, knowing that they can't leave me. They can't text anybody. You know, in the new age of texting, you see, you can break up via text message. Horrible. Why don't you just FedEx them, send a smoke signal, send the EMS, send a CNN, ABC, one, two, three. These hands express. These hands know. These hands feel. They feel like they're never going to leave. They're never going to go away. These are the only two girls I can trust. And I'm going to call my hands girls because these hands have been around a few girls. But I was committed. I never left. I never cheated. I never went away. They left me. They cheated. They went away. These hands have experienced a lot of different feelings, a lot of different vibes, a lot of different auras. They have experienced everything with me and they are still with me. So to call them new, maybe not so new, but we will call them consistent, prolific, and dedicated. Because these girlfriends, these hands, the this skin that I'm in represents everything that is forever. Because these hands, this grip, this nature, these fingers, these fingernails, these hands, these fists, these knuckles, knuckle sandwich, whatever it is, can put them together. You ain't breaking out. It ain't breaking apart. So I'm here to announce that on February 17, 2017, I have finally found the two that I know will never leave. Not only you, but they'll never leave me. But I'm not telling you anything you don't already know. Subscribe.